How to cut out parts of a video on the iPhone. First of all, it is important to note that you can't use the camera roll or the photos app to cut out parts of a video on the iPhone. When we open up the photos app and then navigate to a video, for example, this one here, when we go to edit in the upper right corner of the screen, at the bottom here, the only thing we can actually do is trim the video. So that means we can change the ending point by dragging it inside like this, or the starting point by dragging it from here, and then we could save that. Like this we can trim away something from the end or from the beginning. But we cannot cut out parts here from the middle. With that said, we need a different application to get this done. And in this case, it's going to be iMovie. The iMovie application looks like this. You should have it somewhere on your iPhone because it comes pre-installed on iPhones. So have a look if you can find it. If not, with one finger from the middle of the screen, swipe down and then search for iMovie. And you should be able to find it like that. If not, you can always go to the App Store then go to search, search for iMovie, tap on search, and you can then re-download the iMovie application from there. Once you have iMovie on your iPhone, open it up, then at the bottom tap on start new project. Maybe the screen will look like this for you immediately. In any case, the next step is going to be to tap on movie here. You can then choose your video clip by simply tapping on it. And then at the bottom, tap on Create Movie. Now we have that video clip here on the timeline, and above we have a preview window. Now to cut out parts of your video, first of all go to the location where you would like to make the first cut. By having a look at the preview window above, you always know where you are in the video. So let's say I would like to make a cut right here. Then I will tap on the video now in the timeline and at the bottom choose Split. Split is basically iMovie's terminology for cut. As you can see we now have a first cut here in our video and we have now two separate video clips. Let's say we would like to cut out this part here, then what we would do is we will first go to the location where we would like to perform the second cut, maybe here, then again we would tap on the video and at the bottom tap on Split. And just like that, we created another cut, and we now basically have three individual clips here. So to cut out this part here in the middle for good, what we would do is we tap on it to select it, and then in the lower right corner of the screen, we tap on the lead. And just like that, we cut out that part. Now we just have two parts left. Please note that this here is not a gap or something, this is simply signaling a transition, because this is where we made the cut before. But when the video will run here in the preview above, you will see that there is absolutely no gap at all. So let us do that one more time. Let's say I don't want this part where I show the magnetic connector here on the side of the iPad. Then I would simply go to the beginning of that part. I don't want that. So yeah, this would be the position where I would like to have the first cut because I want to cut this out here. So we will go to about here. Then I tap on the video here. I tap on split. Then I forward the video. And maybe about here, I would like to perform the second cut. So once again, I tap on the video, then tap on split. Now this middle part here, I will just tap on it. And then in the lower right corner of the screen, I will tap on the lead. And just like that, we cut out that part as well. Once you're happy with your edits, in the upper right corner of the screen, tap on done. And then at the bottom here in the middle, you can tap on the share icon. And we are now going to save the video in our photos app and camera roll. The next step for us is to actually tap here on share video. This sounds a little bit confusing, I know, but we actually have to do this to save it on our phone. So you just have to trust me on that. The next step then is we will scroll down a bit. And as promised, we will then see save video. So just tap on that. And our video is now saved to the camera roll and photos app. Once the video is exported, you will get this message here. The movie was exported to your photo library. I just exported another video now instead, because the other one would take me forever to export. So I'm sorry about that, but for our purposes here, it really doesn't matter which video we export. So this is definitely good enough. So once you get this message here, you can tap on OK. You can close iMovie, then you can go to your Photos app. And at the very end, you will find your newly exported video. You can also tap on the camera, and then tap here on the camera roll. And you should be able to see the freshly exported video here as well. If it doesn't pop up like that, you can also go to all photos here. And you should then find it here in this gallery. Usually it should be the last item like here. That is, if you just exported the video a few seconds ago. 
And this is basically all you need to know about how to cut out parts of a video on the iPhone. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to smash the like button and subscribe for more iPhone tutorials.